Yo motherfuckers at World Battle decided to go ape shit for Sode Ikimo. And not for the guy that started this entire revolution in ABWF. Okay. First of all, jet lag. That's my excuse. Very viable excuse. Didn't get sleep. Sode Ikimo, you think you're dumbass that stayed resident in Japan is a is a winner you you came to you come to Hollywood Florida where I live I would have beaten your ass because of jet lag you old piece of shit understand this Sodikimo you didn't win anything and all you taught my son was the how to be a cowardly hiding piece of shit okay I don't want to go that far but you did it and I know for a damn fact I ain't gonna see you back in America because you're scared of Mr. Sonic, you're scared of my goddamn empire. This is my empire. You can't walk in here and do that shit. And I'm gonna stricken that win from the record books. It didn't even count. If I wanted to go for the world title right now, I could. Matter of fact, I'm feeling trigger happy right now. Matter of fact, this show should be about me again. How about it? Bloomington. If anyone ever re became relevant from Bloomington, it doesn't matter. I didn't expect your ass to come here. No way. Keep making excuses, Dad. That's exactly what bitches do. And you are the biggest one of them all. You see, Dad, ever since I decided to part ways with your ass, with Crooked Marty's ass, ugly face, dipshit, David Prestige's ass, a lot of things changed mentally for me. And one of them was, I've been missing out on a father figure for fucking 23 years. Because all you've been is a cash grab, money stealing, piece of honky shit your whole life. Oh, let me tell you something right now. You got a lot of balls coming back here not expecting me to do something about it. You, you, I didn't turn my back on you, I gave you a lesson. And what you did was stand on the wrong man's corner on the wrong night. And hope Sonic, I can't believe I have to say this, but you want to come back here, you're going to get your ass kicked. That's exactly why I'm here, Dad. I'm here to kick your ass. Because you know what? For years, man, it has irritated me how oblivious you are to everything. Nobody wants you here. Nobody ever wanted you here. Sodi Ikimo did the heroic thing and kicked your crooked ass out. And I'm here to kick your ass. I'm not surprised. Be ready for it. No, 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 not me. No, 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 no. I don't want to kill my son on live TV. I wouldn't do that. Hope Sonic, you want a war against your own family. I'm not here to disown you or anything, but I am here to give you exactly what you deserve, and you're going to get it real soon. I want you, bitch. That's it. I don't, I don't care about punishment. I don't care what else you have in store. I just want, finally, in front of these people, to disown you. Rip the Sonic name out, because it's on my ass anyway, and finally be the hope for ABWF. Oh my God. You are, you are as corny as they come, son. And you know what? You want to a match with me? Really? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. You see, I am a good father and I wouldn't do that. Sure, I may, I may knock you up a little bit, but I wouldn't do what you want me to do. 
No. It's not happening. Because you're a bitch, Mr. Sonic. Because you know I could kick your ass, Mr. Sonic. Because you know that if me and you are in a ring and I put my hands on you, all that anger, all that frustration that you put on me, all the rejection you put on me, me being your son and all, still keep me down with the, me being your own blood. You know exactly what I'd do to you. You wouldn't do shit, son. And I wouldn't do shit to you, understand that. I would never, ever disown you in front of all these people. But there's one guy that has to do just that. Because you got yourself opportunity at collision course against my best friend. Slow down there, kiddo. Slow down there, kiddo. Hey, Hope. Hope. Real brutal words. Alright? Here's the thing, okay? Mr. Sonic, right here, Emerald, my friend, for 30 years, treated me well, always had my back, and it came with patience. Hope? Look, man, I was just a wrestler in this company. I was just busting my ass, just trying to have fun and wrestle people. And I finally got the major opportunity of being alongside him. You just weren't patient. And you made him say a lot of things he regretted, a lot of things he didn't mean. You turned your back on him, man. For Soda Ikimo, a guy who completely ripped Mr. Sonic to shred after Mr. Sonic poured his heart out for him. And Hope, I understand you're his son, but Mr. Sonic granted me permission to hand you your first lesson. Okay? Because Hope, listen, as much of a vigilante you want to act like, as much as you want to act like you're against us, we, we can still be on the same page. But it might take a beating. And that beating comes at collision course, Hope. I'm gonna have to kick your ass, Hope. I'm gonna have to make you realize that you gotta fall back in line. And you will. Your father will give you what you want. You didn't have to do it like this. This was on you, my friend. And I'm sorry for what I'm gonna do. But in my return to action, hope. I'm gonna make you realize no matter what Soda Ikimo did, no matter what he tried to tell you, there is no more, no better influential personality in this industry than Mr. Sonic, baby. And you crossed the line. And you made him become a man he doesn't want to be. And I'm here to fix it. At collision course. I'll see you there, son. Uh-oh! I just heard him smoke. I heard him a little, little, little chuckle there, you piece of shit. Ladies and gentlemen, up next we got